tonight and getting this season going. We'll give you some numbers, a line score as we go here to the top half of the fourth. Andrew Kisner swings at the first pitch. High fly ball left field. Not coming back. He got all of that. That hit almost on the crown of Rocky Mountain. The tall berm past the left field wall. First pitch of the inning delivered, and I mean way out of here, by Andrew Kisner. So low home run, and that cuts the lead in half. It is a two-to-one ball game. Well, we talked about Andrew Kisner and what a tremendous prospect he is. That is a power-hitting, catching prospect, and that ball got out of here, I mean, right now. For those who do not know the ballpark, there is a tall grass berm behind the left field wall. It does have some folks occupying. Somebody got an easy souvenir today, but that's a tall, tall berm, and that ball almost cleared the crown of it. Swinging a chopper, a long one hopper, wide of third base off the bat of John Nagowski. And the count quickly 0 and 1 to the former Hound who singled his first time up. So Andrew Kisner has the first home run of his season, won't be the last. It's got big and strong. Kisner, 6 feet 1, 220. He hit four home runs a year ago for the Cardinals, but man, contact like that, he's going to hit a whole bunch more. That was really whacked. 0-1 pitch drops down and in from Seddon. One ball and one strike. So on the fourth hit of the ball game, the Cardinals get on the board and chop the lead in half, including Kisner's swing. The Cardinals have a run on four base hits. Rockhounds have two runs on three hits. The game errorless. Big swing and a miss by Nagowski. The pitch with some good movement down and away from Seddon. Boy, Kisner started this inning, and apparently he was looking for one pitch, and he got it. So Nagowski, Sosa, and Thomas to follow him. The leadoff home run from Kisner. Pitch to the corner, down and away, not by much. Two balls and two strikes. So a run on four hits for the Cardinals. A couple of runs on three hits for the Rockhounds. Kisner is, of course, delivering the home run. The RBIs for the Hounds came back-to-back. Seth Brown and Sean Murphy in the first inning. Here's the 2-2 pitch, and that ball, that's hard hit toward the left field corner. And I don't think that's coming back. That's going to find the bullpen or over the wall. And back-to-back home runs, and John Nagowski ties this game with a solo shot. So the Cardinals go back-to-back, and boy, those were absolutely laced. Kisner's home run was towering one of those majestic shots. Nagowski's home run got out of here basically before you could say all three syllables of his last name. That ball was ripped. So it is now two runs on five hits, and the last two of those hits have left the ballpark back-to-back here in the fourth inning. 